Okay, we just stopped for a trial, and uh, I just got a bonnie then. We had a double hookup, probably another bonnie, I'd say. What do we got here, mate? Looks like a bonito. Bonnie. Nice oh, yeah. Bonnie, that's a big Bonnie. Good work mate. Yeah. Love it. So I'm just letting the line out, uh, probably about 70 metres I'd say. Probably a good distance. Yep, yep, we're on, we're on! No colour yet. This is a good fish. Could this be a king? I don't think so. I think we've got a Bonnie, but he's certainly, certainly giving you some stick, mate. There he is. That's a big Bonnie. That's one of the biggest Bonnies I've ever seen, personally. The only thing about a small boat, they both get on the same side. That's it, don't rush him mate. That's putting some decent bend in the line. You were fishing with a trout rod. Yep, you are and you're bloody loving that bottom of the boat. <laughs> we're gonna see some action soon. There he is in the water. Beautiful fish. Very, very, very attractive fish to look at. But he's a big one. All we need is a seal or a shark to come and grab him now. Here we go, bring him over into the net mate. I think it's going to probably break your net. But uh, if you can lift well a net. Good fish. That's that right. is a big bonnie mate. That's solid. That is a solid bonnie. Alright, I just put mine in the under floor tank. And Dave, I thought we'll spin around for another one. He's uh, just winding in. Just winding in the lower end so we could turn the boat around and he's on. Oh, I love it, mate. Just winding the, winding the lure in. After the troll, and we're onto a fish. So it's another bonnie. We we're just saying we're on the herogenous zone. This, this one spot, we just keep hitting. I trust Davo's contraption here to hang his phone over the edge. Maybe we'll just wait until it comes back in. Here, here, here we is. go. Nice little nice bonnie, bonnie there. Here we yeah, are. Yeah, Davo. Loving that. Another bonnie. 